A very good morning students. In this lecture, I am going to let you all know the important topics related to the course industrial management for R18 as well as R16 regulation under JNTUH. As you all await that the notification received from the university stating that the COVID pattern where 8 questions will be asked of which you are supposed to write any 5 questions. In this lecture, I am going to cover the important topics related to industrial management as well as certain plans, how to prepare and how to write this course. Before that, I will be starting with unit 1. From unit 1, we can expect 2 questions dear students and do not expect direct 15 mark you can be get, you will be getting A, B or A, B, C. First unit is all about the management, you are supposed to work out the importance of the management, functions and the social responsibilities as well as system approach and tailored scientific management and theory. You can expect one question from this part dear students which is of A and B and make sure that the functions as well as scientific management theory is asked many times. Coming to the second question, it is all about Fayol's principle as well as Maslow's theory and M. C. George's theory x and y is asked several number of times dear students and we can expect this question for this time as well as Herzberg's theory. So, from this part we will be getting second question that is A and B 2 and the first question from this part make sure to cover this all in the unit 1. Let us jump into unit 2. Unit 2 is all about the design, designing organization in that you are supposed to work out the types of organizations such as line, line and staff, functional, committee as well as virtual as well as cellular and their differences as well as the team structure is also asked many times and inverted pyramid structure is one of the important question. It is asked many times in the previous years as well as lean and flat organization structure and boundaryless. This time I am I will be expecting only one question or one and a half question from the unit 3, unit 2 that is about 3 A, B, C, why because there is a lot of theory in the unit 2. So, you will be expecting 5, 5, 5 mark or 10 and 5 split mark. This is all about the unit 2. Dear students, the first and second unit and the third unit is all about the theoretical aspects. So, the third unit is all about operations management. In this, the question is all about the types of production system as you all have studied in CAD CAM related to job shop, mass as well as batch production and they may be asking you the differences and different types of layouts and from these two you will be expecting one question from the unit 3 as well as line balancing RPW method and value analysis its types and its definition and uh, the advantages limitations of urban as well as the ruler site locations is one of the very important question which is we asked as all about the theory dear students this units 1 2 3 is all about the theory and you can expect even two questions from this whereas i have even uploaded a video on how to write the theory subjects to get a better mark please go through the channel and work out and please work out accordingly to score better mark in 4 2 as it is all about the theory so the unit 4 is all about the work study where you will be getting certain part of the problems in from the unit 4. I can ex I am expecting 2 questions from unit 2 this time and it is all about the work study related to the steps as well as the method study and its types and key ratings, allowances and the standard time calculation is one of the very very important question. You can expect this as well as the work sampling problems. This may be one of the first question from the I mean the unit 4 unit 4 question from the uh, one question the I am expecting two questions this times from the unit 2. So, this is one question and the other question is all related to R chart and X chart about the variables and on attributes we will be having P chart as well as C chart and the problems related to this. So, we can expect any one problem or from this you will be getting one problem and from this concept you will be getting one more problem or OC charts they are nothing but the operating characteristics curves as well as single and double sampling problems dear students. So, this time we can expect 2 questions from unit 4 why because it is a lengthy unit and please do work out the problems and student who is unable to work out the problem need to be uh, ready for the plan which I am going to let you know later. In the last unit is all about the job evaluation 
from this unit you will be getting the methods and benefits as well as classifications may be one of the 5 mark question or the method comparison uh, the later you will be getting per ton CPM differences and the problems related to this. This is one of the very very important questions from the unit 5 as well as project cost analysis and project crashing problems too. You can expect the per ton CPM problem from the unit 5 dear students. This is a sure pakka 100 percent gunshot question from the unit 5 this year question paper pattern. So, as I was telling you all that the pattern is of all the, the first three units as well as the fourth and fifth the bit of 70 percent of the theory and the remaining 30 is all about the problematic from the unit 4 and 5. So, I am going to give you certain plans. Plan 1 is for the students who are facing that they are unable to work out and just looking for the pass mark can go with 1, 2 and 3 and if possible they can skip even the 3 they can go with 1 and 2 where that they can just pass that and coming to plan 2 is all about 1, 2 and 4 who are willing to score good marks and the students who want 100 percent of marks can go with 1, 2, 3 compulsory as well as 4 or 5 out of this. Dear students please do work out the problems also from 4th and 5th unit and hope you are going to perform well in this exam and scoring better marks in the final year to increase a better percentage. Thank you. Please do like and subscribe to my channel.